we do not ask life what the meaning of life is. Life asks us, what is the meaning of your life? And life demands our answer. If there is meaning in life at all, then there must be a meaning in suffering. Suffering is an ineradicable part of life, even as fate and death. Without suffering and death, human life cannot be complete. Life is never made unbearable by circumstances, but only by lack of meaning and purpose. The point is not what we expect from life, but rather what life expects from us. But there was no need to be ashamed of tears, for tears bore witness that a man had the greatest of courage, the courage to suffer. An abnormal reaction to an abnormal situation is normal behavior. Man is capable of changing the world for the better, if possible, and of changing himself for the better, if necessary. The meaning of life is to give life meaning. Love is the only way to grasp another human being in the innermost core of his personality. The truth that love is the highest goal to which man can aspire. Life is not primarily a quest for pleasure, as Freud believed, or a quest for power, as Alfred Adler taught but a quest for meaning. The crowning experience of all for the homecoming man is the wonderful feeling that, after all he has suffered, there is nothing he needs fear anymore except his God. To suffer unnecessarily is masochistic rather than heroic. Everything can be taken from a man but one thing, the last of human freedoms, to choose one's attitude in any given set of circumstances, to choose one's own way. There are things which must cause you to lose your reason, or you have none to lose. When a person can't find a deep sense of meaning, they distract themselves with pleasure. Fear makes it come true that which one is afraid of. Sunday neurosis, that kind of depression which afflicts people who become aware of the lack of content in their lives when the rush of the busy week is over and the void within themselves becomes manifest. A man's concern, even his despair, over the worthwhileness of life is an existential distress, but by no means a mental disease. The attempt to develop a sense of humor and to see things in a humorous light is some kind of a trick learned while mastering the art of living. For the world is in a bad state, but everything will become worse unless each of us does his best. Happiness cannot be pursued, it must ensue. The one thing you can't take away from me is the way I choose to respond to what you do to me. The last of one's freedoms is to choose one's attitude in any given circumstance. No man should judge 
unless he asks himself in absolute honesty whether in a similar situation he might not have done the same. What is to give light must endure burning. So live if you were living already for the second time, and as if you had acted the first time as wrongly as you are about to act now. A life of short duration could be so rich in joy and love that it could contain more meaning than a life lasting 80 years. Since Auschwitz, we know what man is capable of. And since Hiroshima, we know what is at stake. When we are no longer able to change a situation, we are challenged to change ourselves. 